Look at this, Dad. All these people came out just to honor you. Oh, it feels good, son. I won't lie to you. Dan Quagmire! Wally! Good to see you. This is my son, Glenn. Nice to meet you, Glenn. You should be very proud of your dad. Oh, I am, sir. It was an honor to serve with him. Come on, Dan. Let's get a drink. Ha! It's great to see you back in your element tonight, surrounded by semen. <laughs> semen. See, Quagmire, I told you he's gay. Shut up, Peter. Hey, you Dan's boy? That's right. Your dad was very brave back in Southeast Asia. He flew supplies in where others wouldn't dare to go. I can't tell you how many loads your dad took when I served with him. Huh? Glenn, I wouldn't miss this night for the world. Everyone here admires your dad. He'd walk into an army barracks and make every private there feel important. Yeah, he just knew how to stroke those privates. Oh, God. Your dad was cock of the walk, Glenn. Every day at rifle training, he'd help me clean my butt. Your dad once drank me under the table. If there was one man you wanted in your hole, it was your dad. Your dad had the best penis in the military. Okay, good. stop! Stop! Everybody, stop! Dad? Are you gay? What? Are you gay, Dad? Oh, Glenn, I'm not gay. Just, just tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. Now, calm down. You're ruining this ball. You know how much I love balls. All right, come on now. That's not helping. Son, you have my word. I am not gay. You promise? I promise. All right. I believe you. But I am a woman trapped in a man's body. And while I'm in Quahog, I plan to have a sex change operation. Oh, come on. Just be gay. <laughs>